Nike Cross Regionals. I'm Greta. Well, hello, boys and girls, and welcome back to The Greta Show. So in case you didn't read the title of this video, I'm going to Sioux Falls for a cross country meet, but I don't know if, if I'm gonna be running in this cross country meet because I had a little accident a couple days ago. I don't know if it can be called an accident, but let me just show you. So this is what my toe looks like right now. Apparently I have a strep infection in my toe. I don't know how that can happen, but apparently it did. I've been doing things to get rid of it. I think I can run. It does not hurt at all. Um, but my mom thinks I shouldn't run. The doctor thinks I shouldn't run. But we'll see how it goes. You know, it's fine. I'll probably decide, like, literally day of if I'm going to run or not. So. But it's the night before we go to Sioux Falls for this Nike Cross Regional race. So I have not packed yet. Um, I'm normally so good about this. But this week I was like, am I going to go on my knob, my toe, blah, 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 blah. And I literally decided this morning with my dad that I was going. And it is tomorrow. So I'm packing tonight. <sighs> Ooh, she's quirky. She's packing a book for a trip. Ooh, quirky. So I only can drive on my permit. So my dad is making me drive a lot of the ways to Sioux Falls. It's like probably like a three hour drive. So I probably won't be able to vlog that much of the car ride because I'll be driving, you know? I need to remember to pack these two things right here because this is what I need for my toe. You're probably like, oh my goodness, Greta, why do you need laundry detergent for your toe? It's because the doctor told me to soak my foot in it. I don't get why. Like, it feels good and it smells good, but like, laundry detergent? La laundry detergent? Alrighty, good morning everyone. It is now the day that we are leaving for Sioux Falls. And as you can tell, it's pretty cold outside. And it's supposed to be pretty cold tomorrow at the meet too. So I'm wearing a University of Minnesota sweatshirt. Um, my Lululemon shirt and then my Lululemon sweatpants that are like the warmest thing I own um, out of my sweatpants and then this Concordia hat which I thought fit with the burgundy but now I'm realizing that it's Concordia and University of Minnesota which is kind of weird but you know we'll live no one's gonna comment on it I'm sure and if they do that would be kind of funny I'm also going to be wearing my super cool Letterman jacket the whole time because it's the thickest jacket I own. So literally two minutes after I said, I don't think anyone will comment on it, my hat and my shirt, my dad just did. We're driving to the school where we're going to meet up for the caravan. Um, <laughs> I don't like that he's doing that while he's driving. But yeah, I'm, I'm discussing whether or not I'm going to run tomorrow because... It just doesn't seem like a thing where you you jump so hard that you push an infection into a bone. That sounds like something a non-doctor made up. It sounds like something I made up when I was younger because I didn't want to work. Hi. Not very good at driving, but here we are. We lost the caravan. It's my fault. It's going okay. I caught up to the caravan and I actually passed everyone in the caravan. So, guess who's winning? And then um, we're about nine eight minutes now from where we're gonna go get lunch yeah it's lunch time and then we're gonna go to the course and i think i'm gonna try running hopefully i don't lose my foot we have arrived at the park it is incredibly chilly um it's probably like 40 degrees and where i live there's no snow on the ground there is some snow on the ground here which is not what i was expecting and not what i want but you know, here we are. I think we're also about to go on a run. Um, I'm gonna try to run. If it doesn't hurt, I'm gonna run tomorrow, you know? Sorry if you see this mom. Um, she doesn't want me to run. My dad wants me to, but here we are. Anyways, bye. Apparently we can't figure out how Letterman jackets work. So I was just asked if I have a higher GPA than subscriber count and unfortunately that is true. Captain, therefore Philly has the, has the authority. I have a strep. We just finished our run. I'm doing this now so no one swears in my video because that's been a real problem. Goodbye. What is that? This is the best thing I own. It says finish on empty. My life is complete. 
made it. By the way, my toe did not hurt at all when I was running, so guess who's probably gonna run tomorrow unless something goes terribly, terribly wrong? That's me. I'm gonna wander around and see what shenanigans I can get into. Say hi. Hi. Introduce yourself. I'm a... Person. Person, yeah. What? I'm, I'm Ben. Yeah. Are you running tomorrow? We hope so. We hope so. That's me. The milk machine says it's only open until 10 a.m., but it's 3 p.m. and it's still working, so guess who gets to work? So someone's parents just brought us cookies. Love, the, love those parents. And one of them started to roll off the table, and then Oliver caught it and ate it. How smooth is that? Kobe! <laughs> I've dishonored Kobe. Okay. Tell them about your mental breakdown while playing spoons. Yes. Um, well, my heart rate went up to 130. My resting heart rate is 49. That's not healthy. Um, That's not I almost healthy. had a panic attack. <laughs> We're sitting in the kitchen and everyone is bored because we don't want to play cards anymore. Look at all those screenagers! Are you kidding me right now? You're gonna have to do like. We're playing Mario Kart! I've successfully lost every single round so far. Mario Kart. Super cute, super camp foot bath with my laundry detergent. I'm also not that confident that this countertop can hold me, so. I'm standing with my foot in the bath for 15 minutes. Um, kinda gonna um, prepare me to go on Survivor one day, you know, 15 minutes standing on one leg. And I'm reading my book, Animal Farm. I have to read like 10 more pages tonight to stay on track to finish it within four days, but I'll probably read more than that because I have a lot of time. Good morning. I'm exhausted. I went to bed at like 10, fell asleep by 10, 15, and woke up at seven. So I got well over eight hours. I'm still so tired. But you can't guess what number I am. It's wound cleaning time. I got my Neosporin and Band-Aid by Johnson & Johnson. Don't, not sponsored. It's doing okay. I don't think I'm gonna die. Ew. Why did I take you to the Band-Aid? I'll cut that out, it's fine. Alrighty. The Band-Aid is secured. And this is the album. Sorry, it's like the Billie Eilish song. Anyways. This is the final look. I look super hot, don't I? Hi guys, I just arrived at the meet. It, uh, as you can see, we have our tent here. That was Ben the person. <laughs> I'm being abused. No. I had a bagel. For breakfast. I had a bagel for breakfast. It was less than appetizing. So we just finished our warm up, and now we're stretching. And we race in. What time is it? Eight forty-two. We race in like a half hour. No, 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 no. We race in twenty minutes. I don't want to.
was two seconds off my PR, but for not running and having a streptococcus infection in my toe, I'm not that disappointed. So I got 1932 and I just finished watching the boys race and I'm really, really cold, but uh, it's kind of doing wonders for my skin. I'm kind of glowing, not gonna lie. Skin is popping off right now, mm, but I can't feel my lip. So that's that. Um, the boys all did so well, so proud of them. And yeah, I'll see you guys probably when I get in the car and, and warm again. Look who I just ran into. It's my friends. I'm Fizz. And I'm Jen. And we're the Larson Twins. <laughs> Super cute. We don't go to the same school, but we're at Nike Cross together. Alrighty, boys and girls, I have arrived at home. And yeah, this is actually the end of the video because I don't have anything else to say. Um, thanks for watching. Love y'all.